All right, guys, me and my wife are over here at the Cliffs of the Noose. Down here is the swimming section, the lake. So we're going to go check it out. Maybe hit a trail or two around the lake and maybe get in the water. We'll see how that goes. So. Now, I don't know if I want to take the sidewalk and go the long way or we'll just take the short way. Let's go this way. It's going to be the rough way, but we're going to give her a try. For me, it'd be rough. For her, it'd be a piece of cake. This time of year, the trail should be pretty smooth. pipes off I don't want to get too hot we'll use them every now and again just to show off this thing's a beast you can leave the pack if you want to just go whichever way I'm gonna kind of just bobbing and weaving as I go Coming back up out of here is going to be fun. I'll probably take the ramp out, the concrete ramp coming up. If I don't run all the batteries down before we get to that point. Slow down and stop and lock them on top. There you go. Perfect example of why we like them locking differentials right there. Go ahead. Well, it's hot in the sun, but it's a beautiful day. Uh, we did notice you got to pay to swim here. You're good. It's nice and slow. And Keep turning your wheels left and right. It should grab. There you go. A little more. Left and right. Left and right. There you go. It'll help you get traction when you do that. It's probably full of poison ivy out here. Yeah. When we find a great obstacle, that's when we will hit it.
that's a good looking view so, all right guys we've made it down a pretty good little trail not very far yet but nice little walk um lake looks good doesn't smell too bad <laughs> so uh i don't know how much it costs to swim here but as you can see they got a nice little swimming section way over there i'm not gonna zoom in on nobody or nothing like that but you got a nice little section so let's see beautiful peaceful day haven't seen too many people walking by yet Across roots, I'm gonna tell you. Well, the one thing about out here, there's a lot of tree, root, tree roots, but uh, not a whole lot of other stuff. Hey, old love bug does good though. It's not the love bug, it's my love's bug. Beautiful view over here in the lake. Let's see if I can't get across some of these taller roots. Here, I'm not very capable of this truck, but and my camera mount goes side to side a lot here, so I'm gonna try my best. I do see the big ants are back. Now I could have put this on the saw back chassis with the leaf springs if I'd have had one. It's the same thing basically, but I like to have a little more articulation. Actually, I wasn't expecting it to do as well as it just did. It's not a big challenge or nothing, but. Mm. We got Marty McFly cruising with the Black Widow, so he's out to impress. She ain't got out the truck yet. It's been a couple weeks, so she ain't going nowhere, I guess. The glue's holding. <laughs> All right, we're going to put it back on the trailer and go find another spot. We just thought this looked like some deep roots to roam on. These little low tires ain't much of it. Uh. 
Well, see if we can come back up this hill again. I don't have the back truck uh, strapped in. It could roll off the tailgate. It's a pretty steep climb right there, guys. Tree down, tree down. Phew, I don't know, they come out and mowed a lot of stuff since they're swimming this year. Probably trying to keep all the snakes down. made a video here in the rain one time and it was a downpour it looked like my buddy Clint was a Sasquatch up here behind this tree and this is where we were hiding we went up in here tried to hide behind some trees didn't work and by the time we got from here over to that boat area we were so wet we were screwed all right guys we're fixing to do what we shouldn't I've drove my trucks through here before, but there's the crossing. There's a bridge we could take, but that would be too easy. We know the bug's going to make it, and I'm going to follow, but go ahead. Oh. It's a little bit of water. ain't going to hurt nothing. It's not that deep, really, see? She's testing the waters for me. Her first uh, mud run adventure, I guess you'd say. Nothing to worry about, huh? You think we can make it with this big baby? What do you think? I got things in here that probably should not get wet, but we're going. We can't back out now, so lock them in, low gear. This is go. No problemo. A little batteries underwater, but it'd be all right. Like it wasn't nothing. All right. Well, that wasn't no issue, was it? Come right across there, which we knew we would. I've seen it a lot deeper. So now, I'm gonna go ahead and break off the high trail. As we'll get these tire foams wet so we can break them in a little bit.
I don't have mine locked right now because I don't really need them, but. I think we better lock in just to make a nice smooth run. I'm going to just turn around here and head on back anyway. You can turn around and lead the way back. Nice little straddle log there. Next upgrade for your truck's gonna be the Hobby Wing Fusion motor like I got that can go super slow. It takes some of that windy noise away. Yeah, now I need me a dang adapter to go from the Hobby Wing Fusion SE. Uh, I can't remember what them plugs are called, the yellow adapters, and convert it to a Dean's. I got the adapter on here, but I only have one, and I have to have them for two trucks. Uh, fire ant.
So basically now it's a big hill climb all the way up. I was running second gear, but we'll probably just put along in first. second gear would be good or not, probably not. The chances of the battery making it all the way up is pretty slim. tired holding this thing out like this. Well, we just got to take the ramps, but uh, we we'll just go up. I'll try my luck going up. Or you want to go check on the water? It doesn't matter. All right, we'll go up. I'm going to try the steepest way. I don't want to go all the way around. I'm really surprised that the battery makes it to the top. This is a lot steeper. A lot steeper than it looks. My high trail would not pull a trailer by itself. I know that. I tried. Not uphill. And now I'm pulling three trucks and a trailer. Or two trucks and a trailer, but three count mine. And we're there. Oh boy, thank God. Of course, it did have a full charge before I came. We've been out here for at least an hour. When you're pulling all this stuff for weight for an hour, that's a pretty good time. Second gear, hold up. Yeah, we better stay in first. On this one. That's Battery gets low, and you try to second gear, it'll go just as slow as first. All right, guys. Next time we will probably go swimming, maybe tomorrow. And I'm gonna bring the tank tracks up here for the be on the beach. 